that was a snazzy intro, that wasn't it. Anyway, so hi guys, we're playing Wario Land 4 on uh, normal mode. Because frankly, if I tried it on hard mode, well, it's not that hard, but uh, it's been ages since I played this. So anyway, our plot revolves involves Wario, our intrepid adventurer slash fat greedy bastard, who wants to get rich quick by stealing shit from a shiny pyramid of Edward Cullen. Or at least, that's what it appears like, and there's the kitty! So we venture deep within the shrine to our sparkly, um, douche god thing. And where'd the kitty go? You go down to follow the kitty! Because the kitty is good. He is a kitty. Or she. It. Is a kitty. And we do tutorial stage! Dun dun dun! And you fall like a tard. And we get up there. Now it's been ages since I played this game, so I'm probably gonna be like very terrible. Please forgive me. It's been like literally since I was like, a child, and I still had a my old purple GBA. And we can't headbutt those guys to death, so I'm just gonna smash her little guts all over the floor. And kill you and I get my shiny he's a shiny rock Wario has a lot of pent-up frustration he likes to break things with his head and his butt and his fists Wario does not talk with people words he talks with his fists oh Wario that is not diplomatic in the least violence never leads to any weird thing now work that thick skull of yours and smash through stuff. Bonk! Get out of the water. Now it's not time to go swimming. There's probably a shark in there. You just ram your way through everyone else. Because your overpowered skull makes it so. Then you get so mad you're gonna break things with a rock! And you're gonna crawl. So mad! I can't jump there. Don't throw. No! The coin! The coin! I was gonna grab the coin! Stop smashing stuff and smash more stuff. This is really the whole essence of this game, isn't it? Sorry, I had to sneeze. And, Ow! You had a spear! That wasn't very nice. Yeah. Well, that was a bit embarrassing. Anyway, let's go rolling. Because you're Sonic now. And you get the lazy bastard, aka the key. No, seriously, he's so lazy. And. I wanted to kill you with my butt, but changing your color is okay too. Wait, shit! You made him rabbit! Ah! You die. And I was supposed to use this corpse to get up there, wasn't I? Eh, bummer. Can I? Can, can I? No. Okay, fine, Mr. Kinos. Let's, let's. Kinos is like ten times cooler than anything else in this game. Like, he's got a key for a nose. How does he smell? Terrible. <laughs> That's terrible. I, I apologize. This is why you shouldn't allow me to do this kind of stuff so early in the morning. And I'm realizing now that the sound on the game itself is lagging a little bit. So, you guys have to be patient with me there. And, oh, a whole minute. Whatever shall I do? How about get in the hole? You lazy hippie. Or not. Out of LSDO vision, and you got the shiny. Best score! Only score! Oh, and thank you, game. That's, that's very sweet of you. Then he opens the door. With his nose? With his face? That is so much cooler than anything I can ever do. Last time I tried to open the door with my nose, I just ended up, like, bleeding all over the floor. And 
And I guess I'll show you guys the mini games. I'm not really gonna put any effort into this because it's the mini games. Woo. Baseball! The only thing Wario related in this baseball game is that the ball has Wario's face on it. You can't really see it. Because uh, I'm probably going to strike out because I was never good at this one. Oh! Home run! Yay! Okay, let's just go more. And miss. Uh, I might as well just sit here and wait for it to, you know, pass because... Bonk. No. Astro. Right out. Game over, man. Game over! Okay. Uh, let's play Wario Roulette. Is this one isn't... Is, isn't annoying in the least. No, it's not that bad. It's simple enough concept. Look at the face. Memorize the face. Find the face within the spinny, spinny objects. Nothing complicated. And then Wario's face. Sometimes you just get like something easy, like just recreate Wario's face. Whatever. It's not a big deal. Yeah, but sometimes I just get bored and try to make the silliest face I can. So happy. So happy about getting game over. What kind of salon changes your entire face anyway? I just noticed that. And then you've got a wheel. You're riding on the impossible wheel. Being a champion. Hopping over things. Including an old man eating onigiri. And just... Okay, that was the mini games that I lost. I didn't even get one coin thingy. It's coin thingies help you buy items so you can kick the boss's asses more appropriately, but, uh, meh. Hi, kitty. Hi, kitty. I'm going to face my eminent doom. Doom! Doom! At the hands of an eggplant. Eggplant! Eggplant! Ah. What the hell? You know what? Eat fist. Eat fist, Dr. Dork. His face becomes increasingly more um, frightening as you go along. Until you get- HOLY SHIT! You see that thing in your nightmares? Get over that thing! Shit, that thing come near me, I kill it. Okay. I hit you in the butt. You get mad, so you smash it in the butt. It always turns around, which uh, is kind of annoying. There. It explodes into little mini eggplants, and you get the greatest victory screen ever! Clear! And then, whoa! Cutscene, action, activate! Wow, it's a pyramid growing out of the ground! Pyramids don't usually grow out of the ground! This is mysterious! Passage made of emeralds, rubies, sound room, topaz, and sapphire. Well, emerald is nature, red, ruby is machine, yellow is toys, and blue is sapphire is scary and that's pretty much it so i'll see y'all later ciao